Hello and welcome back to Stranded Deep, welcome back to Pacific Paradise and welcome back to this island that we find ourselves on. Yes, we've been here before but we've come back because we're looking for clay in order to finish off our harbour. This, this boy is very dead. Um, anyway, 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 so we have in our pants, we do not have the tools required to find clay, to mine clay, to turn clay into the things that we absolutely desire. Also, for some reason I came out this way with a load of balls in my pants and I'm just like, why? Why, why didn't nobody tell me? My, my pants were full of balls. I just had to sit here for five minutes while the game was just like, oh, by the way, your balls are floating away. And I'm like, don't, what? Why are my balls floating away? And the game's like, oh, you know what? I do not know. I was not programmed with instructions on how to uh, gather your balls. And I'm like, that. so the boy ball scrap. Hmm, good. There is clay there. So I need about 10, I think, because we're going to need to put a roof on it. Oh, there's clay there as well. Oh, this is fun. I love gathering clay. I don't... don't like it. Um, can we long arm this? Maybe? Maybe? Am I hitting it? Yep. Nope. Okay. Cool. Love it. Love to see it. Gonna go get some air. So the main problem with this, there's two problems. It is 13.03, so 1.03 in the afternoon, which means it's going to start getting a little darker. I don't know where the clay went. Ooh, oh, there it is. Um, also, sharks. There's going to be sharks in the area where I'm kind of keeping an eye out. Um, fortunately, this is all on the sand. What was that? Okay, nope, we're all right, we're all right, we're all right, we're all right. I don't want a shark just straight up jump scaring me. That wouldn't be good. That would be terrible. So we have uh, four, five, six. Oh, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, we can. We could probably do it. Unfortunately, no. Yep, yeah, no. We do have the space. We do have the space. In my pants. My pants do have the space to take on more clay. Hmm. Hello, fish. All right. Unfortunately, there's so much clay. There's more clay over there. It's probably worth gathering it. All right. I hate doing this. I hate it. I hate it. One. I wonder if we just mine the clay and grab it off the beach, uh, off the sand. Is that easier? No, because all the things are there and it, it flops around. All right. Air, air. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good. Probably grab that. And then... All right. Is this everything? Hmm. All right. I got it. I got it. So one of three... Hmm. Four, eight, nine. Uh, I think we missed one. I think we've got a missed one. That's a little bit unfortunate, but that's it's fine. It's fine. They tend to fall into the coral or bounce around, and then I'm just like, I don't know where they went. I have no idea. So let's drop, drop these in the box. The box is now relatively full. Did I, there are some containers on the beach which I could use. That's fine. All right, all right, we'll do it. So yes, gathering clay. It's a little bit of a pain in the butt, but not the end of the world. What is the end of the world? Fish. What is the end of the world is... Can we get out there without triggering a shark? Probably not. Ooh. Ooh, I'll take it. How come we haven't been here before? More clay! Ooh, alright. And then we swim back. Swim as fast as you can. You can't catch me. I'm the boy with the wood container in his pants. Good. Well, I'm glad we gave this conversation. So, so far no sharks, but we have exactly what we need, which is a bunch of stuff we may end up spending the night on this island. Hmm. Bit of a pain in the butt. Bit of a pain in the butt. Two... 240. Hmm. All right. I wonder if we... Oh, there's more islands over there. There's one... Two... I don't know... Ooh. Have we, have we been that way? I'd probably suggest that we have. Let me grab this. We haven't seen any sharks yet. It's getting very late in the day. It's 2.50. Now, the main problem with that is that it's going to start getting very dark underwater. Like, super dark. Uh, maybe I can long arm a bit more clay, and then we can get out of here. Hopefully. Hopefully. Um, whoa, hey, that's exactly what I was thinking might happen. It's a hammerhead. Ooh, okay, can we can we nail this guy real quick? Hey buddy! 
I don't know where he went. I was getting super dark underwater. I don't know where he went. Where did he go? Where did you go? I don't see his fin. Okay. Okay. It's nearly... Well, it's getting close to four o'clock. The water is getting super dark. It's not a good time to be down there. It's got to the point where you can't see what you're doing. Hmm. I think... Is that the sharp music about to start? Or is that just the midday music? I think there's three sets of music. There's morning, midday... And there's like... There's an evening music, but there's also a, a music that happens... It just kind of happens. I'm going to put this on the raft. It's got some use, useful stuff in it. The shadows are going to be a little bit more flickery around here because of the... Just the way they are. Just the way they are. I just... I realised something. We didn't bring any... I mean, we got some rations. Um, we didn't bring any food with us. No, we got some ration tins, that's okay. So yeah, 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 baby, yeah, yeah. If you haven't, if you've ever seen what happens at the end of the day, the water becomes like soup. It's very, very, very murky. Don't like it. Don't like it at all. Oh, those god rays are quite nice. Lovely. Um, okay, good. So I'm going to toss the bed down. I'm going to toss the lamp next to it. You always need a lamp where your bed is. Probably just so you can see what's going on. We've definitely been over there. Absolutely, where the container ship is. I think the container ship is actually a little bit too low in the water to get inside. I think that was the that was the issue. So what was in here? Ah, a bunch of things. Bunch of things. Why did I leave a refined hammer on the beach? Hmm, weird. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it. What we could do is pop the flare up in the sky and that'll give us light. Oh, did you know you could fire a flare up into the sky and you would get light? Yes, I do. They also last, last eight. They also ask. They also last an incredibly long time. Just like an, a seriously long time. Hippity hoppity. I can show you how long they last. So I think it's about. Hmm. I want to say six to twelve hours. Do 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 do. We'll fire it when the we'll fire it when the sun goes down. They got two shots in them. They're completely useless otherwise. Uh, oh yeah, no, we have been on this island, because this was the weird little container that absolutely had n They never have anything in them. You can hammer them apart, but that's only useful if you happen to be on the same island that the uh, the container is on. Oh, I suppose you could build a massive raft and try and hoof, hoof the parts out back to your home island. Um... I mean, yes, yes and no. Because you can take the four walls and you can take the door off by just literally hitting them with an axe until they break. It takes a long time and then occasionally the panels just get stuck on the inside because they become a physics object and it is a complete pain in the butt to actually move them. Uh, time is 17.07. Can I... Oh, I was like, can I get up there? No, no. Our, leg, our little legs are just not long enough. Oh, we got a little tiny... Little tiny getaway sticks. Oh, okay, fine. Uh, oh, what we could do? Food and water situation is fairly low. But what we could do is prepare for the morning by getting ourselves a bit of coconut. Now we can, well, we can climb the tree. Hold space bar or hold jump next to the tree. Grab the coconut. And then you're up in the tree. Just kind of looking around. There used to be a, oh, there it is used to be a bug which would fire you from the tree up into the stratosphere. And then you could do nothing as you came down. You would just be like, oh, I'm, I guess I'm falling now. Yes, yeah, you would you would fall straight to your doom. You'd just be like, hi, hey, welcome to my doom. You would survive if you hit the sea and if you hit the land, you break something. It's like, oh, my bones are broken. So yeah, we don't have much time before the sun goes down. So I uh, may as well just watch it disappear beyond the bow of the boat. That is quite a striking sunset. It's got to be said, this game is absolutely beautiful when it wants to be. Absolutely terrifying when it also wants to be. Kind of a strange, strange thing that. Anyway, the sun has gone down. It is now six o'clock. Um, something cool. Bonk. And that will just stay there for a bit. And now the island is red. It's like, I, I'm on this new island and I need light. 
All right, cool. Actually, oh, that's weird. The light's only over here. Oh, I didn't realize that it was only a very small area. Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, we can do it again on this side of the island. It's not a problem. Not a problem. It's only a problem if you make it a problem. So we can go... Bonk. Now it's empty. It's done. Don't need it anymore. Ah. The red... The healthy red glow in the jungle of maroons lighting up the jungle. Of the jungle being lit up, lit up by maroons. I'm going to go to sleep. Mm, I'm going to go to sleep. Uh, so we're going to save and then we're going to sleep. And then we wake, and it is 4.14 in the morning, we are, we're thirsty, we need to drink. Um, so we're going to have a ration pack, which is fine, it's fine. And then we're going to drop down the coconut, give it a little tap, which makes it, whoop, makes it a drinkable coconut. And then we are going to give it, we tippity top on food, yeah we are, weird. We can't drink any more coconut today, because what will happen is, um... Now, two things. I'm getting two vibes from this. First of all, uh, I'm getting a full-on... I should be listening to Jefferson Airplane White Rabbit. Uh, looking at the jungle lit up by maroons. And then also the sort of the red beach look. I'm sort of getting a Lost Boys, there should be a dude with a saxophone on the beach vibe as well. I don't know. I just, I just kind of get that Santa Clara vibe. Anyway. Gonna eat those even though we didn't need to. Oh yeah, the bats. So the bats, you can actually shoot down if you're if you're good enough. You can trap them. Look, uh, there's a bat up in the tree. I didn't like notice that. They don't like the light on them. But the bats do roost in the trees. I found that the other day. I was just like, wait, what is that up in the tree? Because I was getting stuff prepared between sessions. Is there one there? No. I was getting stuff bet uh, prepared between sessions and I saw a bat and he was just like up in the tree where the coconuts are. But yeah, if you turn a torch on onto them, they'll they'll bounce, they'll boogie. I'm just like, what? Really? Yeah. So if you wanna if you wanna take out a bat, you if you're quick enough, you can just smack him with an axe. One hit and it'll take him out. Same thing with a uh with a seagull. Anyway, the shark is still out there. He's not gone anywhere. We still need the clay. We need the clay. Tell me where the clay is. It's like, I don't know. All right. All right. Don't mind me. I'm going to just grab another box of stuff. One that's fairly empty. This one. And just put the stuff in there. And then we have a nice empty box. Good. Excellent. Why do you have an empty box? Well, because we need... Uh, need more space for the clay, which is why we came out with one one semi-empty box and then two... Well, yeah, we could find extra boxes around here. Uh, it is getting close to the morning. The sun is going to come up on this side of the island. 5.47. You can't probably can't tell. The sky is kind of pink-ish. And those are seagulls. So the bats have been swapped out for seagulls. Seagull lands there. Seagull lands on the rocks. You can make a trap for the seagulls. Good, as the sun comes up on what will be a beautiful day in paradise. We have work to do. We have work to do. More work. Boom, there it is. There's the light. So I'm going to pack up the camp because we need to. Uh, that is the empty wood container. I'm going to put that on the raft. We should be fairly safe here. It's not that deep from what I remember. So we should be fairly safe. Um, so we can put our stuff on here I have a lot of crap I should really get rid of some of this really get rid of some of this I can't put it in there uh, I'm gonna get well oh, get rid of you guys put you in there the guy on the oh no the clarinet the guy on the clarinet is already given it the source there you go so that's stacked stacked and empty good and somewhere out there is a shark and is like swimming around. But 
The water is super dark. We need to wait until about nine o'clock. Or, so what is that moving? Oh, it's a crab. He's stuck. He's literally stuck in the rock. Like part of him is stuck in the rock's geometry and he can't get out because the rock has like a bounding box around it. He will be there forever unless we release him with an axe. To the face! Nah, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna do that. Um, it's so dark though. 6.55. Ooh, I'll tell you what we, uh, i tell you what we could do. We need to wait until 9 o'clock. Uh, food and water situation's not too, too bad. Yeah, um, hmm. I'm just gonna wait those two hours. I'll catch you in a moment. Okay, it is now nine-ish in the morning. Uh, we need to go and see if that clay is still there and then take out the shark if still in the area. It is a lot clearer underwater, which is nice. So we're gonna jet in this direction. There is a clay node. Don't know where shark is. Do not know where shark is. Oh, good. Well, there's no music to warn us of shark in the area. And that's not a good sign if you just go and pick up a little bit of clay. All right, cool. Cool. Also, I don't have a bandage. Just remembered that. No bandage. Can I long arm this? Yeah. Yeah. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Uh huh. I don't know how much clay was still here. I don't know. Was that the clay node we were working on? Oh, maybe. I don't know. I mean, that's two, three. One of three. Okay, fine. We got three clay from that. I don't know where he went. He sort of bounced into the area and then left. And I have no idea what that means. We may end up just going back to Home Island, maybe? Because we got a fairly full cargo. I was going to bring the gyrocopter out. Oh, no, the music just stopped. The music stops for one of two reasons. Either, sometimes when you break the surface and go underwater, the music just stops for literally no reason. If it starts when you're underwater, then it's fine. If it's start, uh, if you break the surface and it's already started, then it stops just randomly. The other issue is there might be something in the area and it's just like, I'm going to stop the music now in order to just kind of prepare for the shark. Um. There is also a poison boy right there. Hello! Mwah. So we've just been kiss, kissed on the lips by a stingray. Is that a stingray? Yeah, a little stingray. Cool. They're a member of the shark family. Ooh, what did they do? Um, They be shark, basically. Yeah, so I think what we can do now is probably head back. I don't think he's going to... I don't think he's going to be in the area. I think he booked. I think he's gone. Right, okay, fine. Fish. Nice. Um, I'll just swim around here just in case he does spawn in. No, no, I think we're good. I think we're good. Right. Fine. Well, we got exactly what we needed, which was the last of the clay. We have all the bits that we need to carry on working on our, uh, our harbour. The Mulberry Harbour. Yes. Absolutely. So we have... Oh, actually, we'll probably do with putting some new, new... More. More gas in the tank. So we'll do that. Cool. Put that in there. And then we have... Yes. Yes, yes, yes. So many. So much clay. All right. Island, it's been good. I'm gonna bounce. I'm gonna boogie. I'm gonna get out of here. Yeah, see, the music starts up again, but if we were to break the surface... I'm just keeping an eye out for sharks, maybe... Nah, weird, he's he's gone. Whoa. Nope, that is literally just a rock. Okay, goodbye, goodbye island. Have fun being an island. For the rest of your island days. I don't know how to get back. I think it's that one and then one over, maybe? Good, 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 good. So we have exactly what we needed to come for. And not... Well, actually, we've got some extra bits and pieces. On... Cool 
whose raft is it anyway? It's mine. It's... Whoa! Hello? Hmm... Did you see that? Uh... I thought I saw a whale. Maybe I did. Oh, there he is. Uh, there's a tail. Oh, we can go and investigate. Yeah, the home island is over there, so I see it on the horizon. That's fine. Um, our turning circle is that of this huge, a huge turning circle. So let's go and have a little look at the whale. I'm not going to jump in the water with him. Not this far out at sea because well, we're out in the middle of nowhere. I don't want to do that. We can give a give him a little peep as we go past. Huh. It's a whale! Hello, whale friend. How are you? It's the tail of the whale. Yep, <laughs> yep. I uh, have a little problem with the turning circle. It is huge and... Did I mention how big the turning... I mean, look. We, turn, we started turning when we were at his bum, and now we're miles away, so that's fine. Humpback whale. Are they native to the Pacific? I don't know, actually. I know about them, but I don't know... I don't know where they live. Nissa, I thought it was... Um, uh, where's the place with the Golden Gate Bridge? I got Santa Clara in my mind. I got it stuck. It's not Santa Fe either. It's San Francisco? Is that it? The Golden Gate Bridge? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know America. I don't live there. It's the one with the whales. And they fly a Klingon bird of prey and then go back in time by slingshotting around the sun. That's the, that's the one. That's exactly what it is. The search for Spock. Anyway, we're gonna, we're gonna carry on. Um, so the house is looking good. We can see the Dakota and we can see our sail out ahead of us. I'm wondering if the whale will follow us in, but I think we're going too fast for it. I have a feeling it'll despawn. It does use shark mechanic for... Uh, oh, look, you can see the end of the... end of the pier. Nice. <gasps> rocks. Oh. Yeah, what's not so good with this harbour is the fact there's a bunch of rocks everywhere. So we can... give it all beans. Okay, whatever. Okay, okay what, whatever. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. We'll do it live. So we started making our island. Uh, our, our island. Our. I'm going to put you over here and just pop the anchor down. There we go. We started making our harbour. Uh, Drumbones was like, who? Can you do a? Can you do a floaty thing? I'm like, can I do a floaty thing? Yes. Can you make a mulberry harbour? So we've got part of a, um, part of the quayside. And we need to make these. We need to make some more of this. I'm thinking like a T-section across the end, which floats, which is fine, which is why we have the boy ball. Uh, okay, so what we also need to do is make sure my pants are not so full. Grab the clay, which is this one, and then turn it into brick scrap. Good, 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 good. Yes, and for that, we need to go up to the tree house. The tree house? The tree house. One of these has uh, more balls. So I do have enough to make another couple of raft sections. I don't know whether to make them mini rafts or like um, one big raft. I think I think rafts of two sections, maybe two by two, will be a good idea. So we'll hoof under here and the house. For anyone who hasn't seen it, it is a house. It is big. It is beautiful, and it has has some cool features. Like the mezzanine. I, just, I love this. I just love the mezzanine. Like the ability to wake up in the middle of the afternoon and go, Ooh, I wonder if the, I wonder if the postman's been. The answer is no, because you live on by yourself on an island in the middle of nowhere. But it's a good, I mean, it's a good thing. Uh, we do have a pile there. Oh, cool. Yeah, we can just hoof the stuff into a pile. Um, I'm just going to, in which case, uh, drop this down. Grab all the stuff out of the box. Hmm. Yeah, grab all the stuff out of the box. I'm going to put it in the pile. 
for reasons. Everyone's like, but you can just make the brick scrap. And I'm like, yes, I can. But if you put it in the pile, because we have our kiln and our brick station actually in the tower, what we can do is just... Because everything counts as being in front of us. So we can just craft like a mad person. And then the last bit of clay is left on the pile. How amazing is that? I think that works quite well. I think it works amazingly well. DC3, the Dakota. The RAF called them Dakotas. I think the Americans called them DC3s. Are they related to the C-47 Skytrain? Ooh, I don't know. Again, all these questions. And I don't know the answer to them. I mean, I could probably find out. Let's grab the boy ball, because we need it. Um, we have some hammers on the raft. Check our food and water situation. Water is quite low, food's not too bad. I do have food here. There we go. And you have to do a little duck as you go under there. That's the only downside. I mean, we could have just walked off onto the helipad because we do have an open door there, but, 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 but. That's what we did. We didn't, we didn't do that. We did something else instead. We walked down onto the beach and have a little drink. There we are. Now we're tippity top. These guys are empty. Eat. Uh, and I'll just top these up because there's no point in having your water stills not doing anything. But uh, you have your, your water skins. Yes, but if we can just drink out of the faucet and then top them up, why would we not do that? I mean, why would we not do that? Uh, there is another brick scrap in one of these boxes. Probably that one. Excellent. And then we can... We can build. We can build. We can build if we want to. We can leave our friends behind. Because if they don't build... Then they don't build. And then there are no friends of mine. I'm just wondering where we should put the little hut. So, from an aesthetic point of view, the little hut should be down near the end of the harbour wall, but, 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 if we put it right on the end, which we can, does it just make it look a little bit weird, like an abrupt stop? If we put it one back, it gives us a little, like a soft stop, I guess? It's just an aesthetic thing. So I'm going to do brick half walls. Um, here and here, I guess. Now, is that on the inside? Which is the outside? That's the outside. That's the inside. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. Fine. I'll I'll do it. I'll do it. We're gonna quick craft brick half wall. And then we'll need a uh, roof section and the roof wedge, roof cap. It's only one brick scrap. Oh, wow. I thought it was more than that. So we have a bunch of brick left over. Oh, I had no idea. I had no idea. I thought we had less than that. I thought it was much less than that. And it turns out that we've got much more than we thought we had. Well, okay, yeah, that kind of makes some sense. So what we can do is do this. Let me, I mean, we could go completely ham on the harbour and just really, really just um, make it a working harbour. I'm, I'm okay with that. Okay, good. So we've got a little hut. A little, a little, just like a step-through hut. What does it look like from the side? Probably not great. But we can we can work with it. Uh, if we run down here, yeah, it's just a little little hut on the end of the harbour wall. Um, I'm wondering if we can do another foundation section on the end. Hmm, it's going to mean moving this guy. Uh, ba -ba -ba foundation, yeah, because we won't be able to build anywhere where the raft is. That does kind of snap. Okay. You come with me. I realize my folly. Yeah, you see, this is a bit of a problem. These things going to be a little, little bit of a problem. The sun is also going down on what was a beautiful day in paradise. We only have about 10 minutes left. Okay, fine. Fine, fine, fine. I'm... I'm going to go up to the house. 
That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to go to the house. I'm going to go up and see, the, see what's upstairs. I'll tell you what is upstairs. The DC-3. But also, also, also light. Because all the lights are going to come on. Excellent. So, 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 so. As we walk onto the roof of the house with the little lanterns. Everyone said I was stupid. Ooh, you're stupid putting little lights on the roof. But no, I think it works quite well. Nobody said I was stupid, but it does work quite well. Anyway, uh, we'll leave it there for the time being. We'll finish off the harbour or carry on working in the harbour more accurately next time. And I'll tell you what, if you, uh, if you want to throw the video a little like, it helps it be found by YouTube. Um, if you want to do a little subscribe, it's free, absolutely free, and it does help the channel out. And if you want notifications, hit the little bell, and if you don't want notifications, don't hit the little bell, and I'll tell you what, I'll catch you next time.